YouTube, I decided to do an update. I actually have good news for once. After my horrible video rant, vent, whatever that last video was, I kind of got myself together, or sort of like a kick up the ass, and I haven't binged or night eaten in six days. I've literally um, just stopped. I eat. I've been eating at least two two meals a day, and if I miss a meal, I don't make up for it at night by eating a ton. I literally just eat my calories and realize that it's it's a it's a mental hunger, not a physical hunger, and I'm realizing that I get mentally hungry quite often. Um, probably most of the day. After I eat, I still feel like I want to eat more. It's just part of the addiction. But I'm managing it, and I haven't binged. And another good thing is I've been in between sizes. I had my size of my jeans or my pants. Were they too big or too small? And today I tried them on, and I got into the smaller size. And they fit perfect, and they're not too big. And they're, they actually... So I'm losing a little bit of weight. That's a good sign. Um, so I'm back in my jeans, which feels pretty amazing because it's been quite a few months since I got into my jeans, my multiple pairs of jeans, so that's, I'm excited about that. Yeah. <laughs> um, what else? I go to the eye doctor today to see if there's anything wrong with my eyes. Or anything different we can try to see if we can control these headaches. I get them pretty much at least four days a week I get headaches. And some of them are pretty severe. Yesterday and this morning was really bad. I took a ton of um, caffeine, Tylenol, well, regular dose of caffeine, Tylenol. And I had ice pack on my head and I was trying to everything to get it to calm down. But it did. So... I don't know. And I'm on this kick. I've been doing... I've heard that turmeric is great for inflammation. So I've been drinking... My friend got me onto this lemon, turmeric, uh, ginger, and cinnamon drink in water. All you do is take two cups of water, a half a lemon, including the rind, the, the pith, everything, the whole lemon. A half a lemon. Um, I use fresh turmeric root I can get at the store. I found it, so I've been putting that in, and then today I tried ginger in with it, and cinnamon, and I blend it up until it's really good blended, and it's really yellow, and then I just down it, and then I honestly, it's like an energy boost, it totally gives me a ton of energy after I drink it, and um, I feel better for it, I drink it every morning, and for the last probably two weeks, and I totally notice a difference. In my energy levels in the morning. I don't need as much coffee. And I just feel better. So um, I don't know if it's just a hocus pocus thing. or But if it has any truth. But yeah I'm trying it. And that's what I'm doing. And it seems to. Um, I don't know if I, I don't feel so puffy. When I drink it. I don't feel so bloated or. Big, but it could be because I'm losing weight, so I can't really tell if it's a drink or my, or the weight loss. But um, yeah, it just feels like I'm kind of on track and I'm doing well right now, in a better place. Yeah, and I do have some possibilities of doing some work with some eating disorder awareness with another, with a project heal with a friend so hopefully we will get doing some of that and doing some education and some awareness because it'd be good to get back into that and do it as well, doing my volunteer work again because that gave me purpose and gave me something to fulfill myself with so and my brother and the bike parts arrived so I just have my brothers coming today to put the bike part hopefully together easily so that I can get my exercise bike fixed and then I can start very slowly. Start from basic 5-10 minutes, maybe 15 if I can. 
a couple times a day and start biking until I work myself up to, uh, back up to full workouts. And hopefully that won't aggravate my knee. We'll see what happens. But it's, it's what I was doing in the physio. I was riding the bike. So, yes, I just... Things are looking up, so that's a good thing. I'm fighting back and starting to beat binge eating disorder, and things are starting to turn around. So everyone have a good day, and happy Valentine's Day to everyone tomorrow. I hope you guys have shared loved ones, and if you don't have anyone like me, share with someone with a friend. It doesn't have to be a romantic. It can be just showing someone that you care about, that you love them. Talk to you later. Bye.